Alarm for the Volunteer Fire Brigade of Westerdeistrich. Location, a campsite. Every second counts. Every move must be spot on to get the flames under control. Deja vu for Fire Chief Axel Kulkowski. He and his comrades had been called to a caravan fire before. They arrived in record time and put out the flames within three minutes. And yet, they were far too late. When the fire was out, we found that two people had been in the caravan at the time, a woman and a child. They were burned beyond recognition, and it took a long time for us to get over that. These are just two of the approximately 400 people who die in fires every year in Germany. Luckily, today was just a drill. It started shortly before this with an experiment. This was meant to show what happens during a room fire and how you can protect yourself. When you're sleeping, only a smoke detector can save your life. To demonstrate this, Axel Kurkowski installs a state-of-the-art smoke detector in the caravan. Then, he deliberately lights a fire. He's going to stay in the room until the smoke alarm goes off. He doesn't have to wait long. Within seconds, the smoke detector is shrieking. If I had been sleeping in there, the smoke detector would have woken me and I would have had enough time to get out of the caravan. From outside, there is still no sign of the fire to be seen. Even so, inside, the room is filling up with thick smoke and this is highly toxic. What we're seeing here in the picture is a lot of smoke being generated very quickly. Anyone inside would have no chance of survival. They would simply succumb to smoke inhalation. A long time before someone notices the fire and calls 112. Actually, it takes almost 15 minutes before the first flames become visible from outside, even though a caravan has much thinner walls than a house. Inside, the room has long ago filled up with deadly smoke and gas. A room without a smoke detector quickly becomes a death trap. People generally don't install smoke detectors unless they have to. And then all we can do is come along and recover the bodies. The Berlin production facility of smoke detector manufacturers Pyrex. 40,000 of these little lifesavers are produced here every week. At its core is the smoke chamber. Here, there is an infrared light and a sensor. Together, they function like a reverse photoelectric relay. This is how it works. Like this camera, the sensor doesn't normally see infrared light. But when smoke enters the chamber, the smoke particles deflect the infrared beam, the sensor recognizes it, and the alarm goes off. Tested, reliable technology. Still, people who don't like smoke detectors have many excuses. Marcus Picher, production manager at Pyrex, knows them all. And also, how to refute them. First excuse, I don't think there could be a fire in my home. We all have a lot of electrical appliances in our houses. A short circuit can happen very quickly. Fires can be started by forgotten stoves or Christmas candles that someone has forgotten to blow out. And you can't help what happens in your neighbor's house either. Maybe pets can replace smoke detectors. Excuse number two. I've got a dog. He'll warn me. When their owners are asleep, dogs are also usually sleeping. Two breaths are enough to knock them out. Three breaths and they're dead. Some people don't like how they look. They say smoke detectors are ugly. Okay, firstly, things like this become invisible, like light switches. You very quickly stop seeing them. And secondly, we have won five design awards for our smoke detectors. They can't be all that ugly. And they can be individually customized. Lastly comes the cost. Excuse number four, smoke detectors are expensive. An inexpensive smoke detector can be bought for five or ten euros. 
We do recommend, however, that you spend a bit more. A good quality smoke detector has a battery life of up to 12 years, a lithium battery from Panasonic, for example. That avoids all the tiresome changing of batteries and it's better for the environment. Saving the lives of sleeping people is the main purpose of a smoke detector, but not the only one. They also indirectly protect your property. Many insurance companies refuse to make a full payout on fire damage if there were no smoke detectors installed in the house. With smoke detectors, both your property and your life are always protected. Panasonic.